Turning overseas, police in France have shot and arrested a man suspected of deliberately ramming his car into a group of soldiers near Paris in yet another suspected terror attack in the country. Noaram has the latest. The French government is calling Wednesday's incident a deliberate attack. Police say the suspect was unarmed when he was captured after an hours-long car chase. They managed to corner his BMW on a motorway about 260 kilometers north of the Parisian suburb of Le Valois Pere, where the suspect is said to have injured six soldiers after mowing them down with the same vehicle at a military base there. Armed police opened fire on the suspect, but they are not commenting yet on his condition. One policeman was also said to be injured by a stray bullet. The troops were part of Operation Sentinel, which was launched in the wake of Islamist attacks in Paris two years ago. France's interior minister said a terrorism investigation has been launched describing how the attack was carried out. A car which was in the area arrived near the petrol. It was driving slowly and then, about five meters from the soldiers, the car accelerated and hit them. So we know it is a deliberate act. What I can say is that the anti-terrorism section of the Paris prosecutor's office is in charge of the case. Investigators have also raided several properties associated with the suspect. He was identified by the daily newspaper Le Parisien as a 37-year-old Algerian national Hamou B, who was staying in France legally. Wednesday's attack was the 15th on troops and police in the last two and a half years, many of them inspired by the so-called Islamic State group. Noara, Arirang News.